Hi, my name is Janelle Perez Sandy. I was diagnosed with stage three breast cancer in July of 2019. My journey began shortly thereafter in August of 2019 with chemo. Um, went through 16 rounds of chemo that got delayed with low blood counts. Then from there, I had my mastectomy in March of 2020, the week that COVID shut everything down. I was one of seven patients that day in the hospital. After that, I underwent um, 33 rounds of radiation. And from there, I had my deep flap reconstruction in November of 2020. I would have to say my largest motivation though is my kids. They watched my mom, my older kids at least, watched my mom battle cancer for six years and then passed away. So when I was diagnosed, it was definitely hard for them to grasp the reality of what was gonna happen to me. So my largest motivation was them and to be here for them. And they know now that cancer is not a death sentence, that it is something that you can overcome. And with the advances in technology and science, this is something that is curable or beatable. Um, and I'm very grateful for everything that has happened. And that's what brings me the most motivation. I'd like to thank my doctors. Um, Dr. Blakely Cute was my original oncologist. She moved back home to Kentucky. And currently I see Dr. Zoe Larned with Auctioner Main Campus. I would also like to thank my surgeons, Dr. Amy Rivera with the Women's Center at Auctioner Main Campus, and Dr. Hugo St. Hilaire with LSU Plastics. During my weak moments, I leaned a lot on my husband and um, my coworkers for support. I really enjoyed their weekly pictures of them flushing out cancer or fighting back with blow up pun uh, boxing mitts. Um, I also had um, one of my husband's coworkers uh, sent me a pair of boxing mitts for my last um, chemo. I rang the bell, but I punched the bell instead with the, the boxing mitts on. Um, so I'd like to thank um, them as well. I'd also like to thank my husband, Mark, my four kids, Caden, Madeline, Max, and John, my father, who also watched my mom battle breast cancer, my two brothers, my sister-in-laws, um, my aunts, who also assisted me with everything, and my coworkers who, on a weekly basis when I was going through chemo, would dress up and send me pictures of Team Janelle. When I walk out on that stage, I hope my kids remember that I'm here, I'm their mom, I will always be their mom, I will do anything I can to watch them grow up. I'm Janelle and this is my story.